So let's try to remove the uh, those productions which are useless production in this. So first, let us find out the useless productions. So S produces AB, A produces small A, capital A in capital A, B produces small B, capital B in capital B. In place of A, I can put epsilon. In place of A, I can put epsilon. In in the place of B, I can put epsilon, and in the place of B, I can put epsilon. So you can see that the S is giving us the string AB in this case. A is also giving us some terminal symbol. B is also giving us a terminal symbol. So the productions with S, A, and B are valid, valid productions. So there's no be useless production in my pass. Three non-terminal, we can reach three of the start symbols. So the only thing is that we will have to remove the epsilon productions here. So to remove the epsilon production, I'll write A S produces A, B as such. First of all, we are removing A produces epsilon. So we have S produces A, B. If you keep A in epsilon, so you will remain with S produces B. Now A produces A, A, A is already our case. If you keep A in the first capital, so you will remain with A and A. And if you keep A in the first capital, so you will remain with only A. Not double A, but only A. Okay. And the third production, that is B produces small b, capital B and capital B and epsilon remains the same. Now, what do we do? B produces epsilon. Ko remove karne ki koshish karte hai. So, production mein A produces AB already. Hai. S produces AB. And then S produces BB. Hai. AB mein, agar aap B ki jaga epsilon rakhenge, so you will remain with A. Now, A produces small a, capital A, capital A. A produces small a, capital A. And small a will remain the same. Or B produces small b, capital B, capital B. Mein, agar aap epsilon rakhenge, so this is B, B, B. After this, agar aap dono mein se kisi ek ki jaga agar rakh denge epsilon, so you will remain with B, B. And agar aap dono ki jaga epsilon rakhenge, so you will remain with B. So this is the simplified version of the grammar. So this is the simplified version of the grammar. However, here you will see two unit productions. One is S produces B and one is S produces A. So if you want, then you unit productions S produces B and S produces A. How remove we remove it? Where we remove it? Where we remove it? Where S produces A, you can attach it to A and the other productions. For example, here S produces A, B and S produces B. A से start होने वाले सारे productions, which means small a capital A और small a capital A या small a. इसी तरह से B की जगह हम लिखने जा रहे हैं B से start होने वाले सारे productions, which means small b capital B capital B, small b capital B and small b. And then A से start होने वाले सारे productions को आप ऐसे लिख दीजिए. A produces this one, then small a capital A, then small a. Similarly, B से start होने वाले productions B capital B capital B and B, capital B, and B. So this is the simplified version of the given problem. So we have steps follow the steps. So just to summarize, we have removed the first thing. Useless productions have removed. We have productions which are non-generating. We have removed them. After non-generating, we have removed non-reachable symbols. This is the second step. Then we have third step the epsilon productions. And fourth step, we have unit productions for remove. Yeah. So these are the four steps that you should remember for the simplification of the gram. So thanks for watching this video.